department researching the long-term impacts of NAS or neonatal abstinence syndrome on babies. Yeah, you know, up until now, there hasn't been any research on the subject. Are researchers instead focusing on the first few months after birth? This new study analyzing data from 7,000 Tennessee kids now finding these babies born addicted to drugs are more likely to have educational disabilities when they get older. Now, these challenges ranging from speech problems to memory issues. Memory is a huge thing that I have seen. Like right now, my child can't sing complete song. Typical twinkle, twinkle. In the information that we looked at, we saw that children that had a history of neonatal abstinence syndrome were more likely to have special education disabilities such as developmental delay or speech or language impairment. Now, Dr. Phil says she hopes parents of NAS babies can use the findings to determine if their children need early intervention services. The doctor is saying there is really good evidence that these programs can help children overcome 